Ladies and gentlemen, I have another 2K video here for you today. This is going to be a special video talking about primary badges and it's going to be about teardrop, okay? This is going to be one of the most hardest badges I was able to grind for the longest time since NBA 2K has came out. This is going to be for my small forward build that's going to be my shot creating slasher and he is officially going to get this on Hall of Fame. Share this video, like this video, pass it on to a friend and let them know that it's possible to do and you can honestly do it if you put the grind on work. You have 10 possessions and you have to shoot floater shots and you've got to use that R3 to actually make this possible. But not only that. I have a couple more videos coming up for you very soon. Please be looking out for those videos and I will be able to show you guys some more. If you guys have any ideas that you guys want me to do, I will be grinding to those badges that you guys see me doing. I have done them on previous and a lot of characters and I have more videos on the way. And NBA 2K is one of my favorite games to play but it always is a stress so when you have your badges it always makes you that much better. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video, like and subscribe and come back to this page and I'll see you again and my name is Chris. So for this drill, we're going to be talking about the technical side on how you're going to have to be doing it. You're going to be using your L3 and your R3. And that is going to make you position yourself close enough to get this animation, the floater animation to go off. And basically what you're going to be doing is um, you're going to be using that L3 and um, your R3 to actually make it perform these moves. And when you do that, you have a chance to get... One star, two star, three stars. When you get one star, you get a hundred. If you get two stars, you get four hundred. And if you get three stars, you get seven hundred. And seven hundred is the max towards every drill, every time you finish it and you complete it. And um, just to let you guys know, it will get harder when you're when you're first starting it. But when you start doing it more times, you start doing it repetitively. You start to see the animation and the body language, and you start to get a little bit more comfortable with doing the drill. And just to let you guys know, please like and share this video to a friend that is looking towards doing this badge and when you get this it is going to give you the highest level of completion and likewise you will be able to hit it on park jordan rec center pro-am in certain situations and i hope to see you guys again and please like and subscribe to this video my name is chris dash bye